Hi there, my name's Corey from Pulse FM, and I'm super excited to let you know about not one, but two summer shows coming to downtown South Bend. We call it the Downtown Summer Series. We've been doing this for a number of years. Here we go again, a chance for the community to come together and hear some amazing music, see some amazing performances. And I'm gonna introduce you to one of those performers here in just a second. But I wanna tell you, morriscenter.org. And I want you to grab a big red marker and circle June 14th, Friday night. Yeah, June 14th. It's gonna be great. Let me introduce you to one of our performers, a young man from down south, Cade Thompson. Welcome to the program. Woo, good to be here, Corey. Super excited for June 14th. It's gonna be awesome. If you listen to Pulse FM for any amount of time, you've heard the song from this young fella, and we invited him last year to come play the party on the plaza outside the Morris Performing Arts Center. What do you remember about that hot summer night? Woo, I remember first thing, it was a party. Second thing, everyone showed up, it was amazing. And people are so, so kind there. So I'm excited to be back. It's gonna be a great time to be in, in inside this year. So I'm very excited. Yeah, I don't know if we've ever done this before where we had someone on the plaza and then the very next year, we got to get you in the big room and let everybody experience what we all experienced last summer. Where does that confidence come from? That's what I saw on stage was a great performance mm -hmm. and a lot of confidence for a young man. Yeah, you know, I started singing when I was five years old on my front porch in Joplin, Missouri, singing karaoke anywhere from Life is a Highway all the, all the way to How Great is Our God. I grew up on Christian music. I grew up on Christian radio. Fast forward to middle school, I started singing at my church. Then by the time I was 16 years old, I went on my first tour. I really had no idea what I was doing. I just kind of got thrown into the fire and that's really how I learned. And now fast forward to today, I get to travel. I get to, to share these songs and these stories with people every single day. And that's what keeps me going. And that's why I'm really, really excited for a special summertime with y'all. Well, you have a very specific memory of singing when you were five on the front porch. Do I dare? put you on the spot and ask you what the song was. <laughs> well, uh, I can say for sure Life is a Highway was one of them. It's kind of funny now that I'm signed to Red Street Records, Jada Marcus from Rascal Flatts started this label. So it's kind of a full circle moment for me. Uh, I also loved Chris Tomlin growing up. He had a big inspiration inside of me. Toby Mack is another one that really, really inspired me. Phil Wickham. So any of that stuff, it's all fair game. Have you had a chance to uh, rub elbows with any of those artists since you've been in Nashville? And, and if so, what's what's that conversation been like? Yeah, you know, I actually have. It's been super, super special. A few years ago when my first album, The Bigger Story, was released, that same day it was released, I got to open up for Toby Mac for the first time. And I was like a kid in the candy shop. Fast forward to now, I've been able to open up for him a handful of times. and. He's really been so, so kind to me. I remember I was nine years old, sorry, 10 years old. I went to my first Toby Mac concert, the I On It tour. And I saw him on stage and I said, look, what he's doing is so special. And I want to be able to do something like that for as long as the Lord allows me to do it. And now we're here. And it's so cool to see God work through, through those moments. I love that. I love that you know that moment when you said, I want to do that. That's a great story. You are currently in writing mode for some new music, and I think you told me somewhere between 40 and 300 new songs. Is that right? <laughs> yeah, definitely more closer to the 40 range, but if I had 300 songs, I might be I might be dead. But uh, yeah, I've been writing a ton, a ton of new music. It's super exciting for me. I love songwriting, man. I love seeing how songs and stories can connect with people, and it's what keeps me going. It's what keeps me going on the road. and. I've been writing a lot, a lot of special songs to me. You know, I think over the past few years, I've really seen that the life is hard and, and a lot of us are going through a lot of different things. But at the same time, I know as a follower of Jesus Christ, I have a God who holds my hand in the middle of it all. And so I've been trying to find those songs that I can really dive into the depths of my heart to share that hope inside of me uh, with, the, with the whole world. Last question, give me three songs. If someone is brand new to Kate Thompson, three songs that I can go listen to on uh, the streaming platforms. Go. First one, Good God. Second one, Arms of Jesus. Third one, Every Step of the Way. 
Kate and I will see you this summer, June 14th. That's a Friday night in downtown South Bend. Once again, we got another show in July too with Big Daddy Weave. Tickets available right now at morriscenter.org. That's morriscenter.org. I'll see you this summer. It never runs dry, overflowing.